Hey, this is PA Ninja, and who do we have here? My name is Airman Chapansky. I'm Tech Sergeant Marcus Young. I'm Airman Ferguson. Uh, Senior M. Stewart. Staff Sergeant Crawley. What? And uh, what does the Honor Guard do? Duty, Honor, Country, huh? What? All right. What is the coolest part about your job? Uh, there's a whole lot of slices of awesomeness, but I have to say the best is uh, doing my job by reading emails and getting things done. I think the coolest part about our job is that we, we're always doing different things. We're manufacturing uh, uh, different parts and uh, machining things. We're not doing the same thing every day, so that's really cool. Do you think we have a DUI problem? By definition, yeah. Not necessarily a problem, just more or less an issue of it uh, being a bigger issue in the United States Air Force than any other corporation in the world. Well, I have only been here since June. I heard that the uh, DUIs were really bad before I got here, and I've only seen two or three, so I definitely think it's uh, improving. But um, hopefully those days uh, out there in front of the sign uh, climb higher and higher. What can we as a whole do different to prevent DUIs? Uh, more or less just uh, stick with our plan. You know, uh, we get in these situations to where we take a left instead of taking that right and we get in these situations. So stick with your plan and everything will turn out fine. Uh, I guess make ourselves open as wingmen to uh, look after each other and provide different resources. There might be a good idea to look into making a more impact on punishment. I know there's it's wishy-washy in gray areas, especially if it happens off base, but if your first sergeant finds out that you're in jail, you should probably stay there. Boom! Hello, this is PN Ninja, and we're here with... <sighs> this guy's funny. Master Sergeant Tiffany Kuchkowski. Senior Airman Nunez. Uh, Airman Robolino. Uh, I am A1C Cameron Skiffington. And uh, what's your favorite part about your job? Uh, my favorite part would be just visiting different organizations in the squadrons, uh, being able to see what type of equipment they have, um, and just being, having hands-on on what every other organization is doing on base. Coolest part of my job is probably dealing with the armory. We deal with weapons, and we get to issue our deployment gear to everybody in the wing. <gasps> uh, what does it mean to be a good wingman? To be a good wingman, um, to me it means you know being there for people that need you get them out of a tough situation and being relied on to always be it, be there for them. To be a good wingman, uh, in my opinion, is just to be uh, there for a friend, uh, for somebody who's in need, um, whether it's somebody that's getting on, just re returning to base from either deployment or uh, PCSing and being able to be there when he moves or when he needs somebody to talk to. Uh, can you tell me a time where you needed a good wingman or you were a good wingman to somebody? I would say I was a good wingman at one point as an airman before I, the wingman philosophy was even uh, adopted yet, back in Nam. Just kidding. And uh, I had a, we were at a party and I had a friend who was going to drive home drunk. And I pretty much almost got into a physical altercation with him to get him to hand over his keys and he wouldn't so I actually we were in base housing so I went and got one of the uh, senior NCOs that he worked for and he came out and took his keys and I thought man I lost a friend he's gonna be so mad at me but actually Monday when I got to work I had a lengthy email from him thanking me for for doing that and not getting him in trouble before driving so tell me a time or an event that uh, you were a good wingman or someone was a good wingman to you all the time. We got, uh, like the other day, a friend helped me pay for groceries because I wasn't able to pay for it at the time and that paid him back. That was good. I got to eat food that day. It was real nice. I didn't starve. Boom!